7.30 in the morning. We got in at 2. Where are we going? Cycle bar. Yee! Cycling shoes can only mean one thing. Friday on vacation. Of course. Sorry, psychology. Gotta do what you gotta do. time since we've been eating outside. No, very long time. Uh, yeah. Did a cycle bar class. Now we're gonna just enjoy some time out here eating breakfast. Brody's still sleeping. We have dinner with friends tonight. Yep. Anything else? No, I'm just gonna enjoy some breakfast. Cool. Cool. We're gonna go to the pool. Cool. Nice day. It's great to come in two days early to a cruise because you need a day to like unwind from traveling, especially after our travels. Oh my gosh, it was so long. We were in airports for over 12 hours yesterday. So, yeah. This feels amazing. Oh, I love it. I love the warmth. It's beautiful. I can see water over there. That's a good question. Which way do we go? So this is the lobby of the Hyatt Centric Fort Lauderdale. Beautiful. And we are going to head to, there's like a canal slash river walk. We're going to go to the left, guys. So this hotel is actually a right around 20 minutes to the port. If you are cruising out of Port Everglades, uh, you can grab an Uber or a Lyft or rideshare, anything to get yourself over there. We chose to stay downtown Fort Lauderdale because it was just a little bit more, uh, the hotels were a little bit nicer and uh, you get a little bit more bang for your buck than the hotels that are kind of closer to the port and the beaches. Um, so that's why we chose to stay here. This is just kind of the area around. <laughs> wow. Go ahead. This is cool. Yeah, this place is really cool. I like it. Um yeah, it's been a while since I've been somewhere like this tropic, tropical. Do you I, miss it? I do. Ah! I'll take this one right in front here. This one's nice, yeah. I'm shocked they were able to turn right there. Yeah, that was a crazy turn. What? <laughs> wow. Oh, should we walk? I don't know, boats yeah. could do U-turn, U-turns. Go. Oh. That was crazy. Um, so one of the things Leanne has been uh, researching is, uh, which is kind of interesting. Um, well, we, as you can tell, we just started using a microphone, so we're gonna see how well this works. But um, she's been researching about how many people are having issues with flights here to Fort Lauderdale. And we had similar issues. We we came in two days early, so we came in on Friday. Obviously, the ship leaves on Sunday, so we came out. We decided, hey, let's give ourselves two days in Fort Lauderdale. Well, it's a good thing that we did. Um, our first plane was delayed about two hours, and our next plane was delayed an hour plus. So we ended up about three plus hours of a delay, and uh, but we made it and we made it by about 1 p.m., which, uh, sorry, 1 a.m. <laughs> I was listening to what somebody else was saying about uh, they were doing a Segway tour over there. So, 1 a.m., we got into the hotel, went to sleep, it was great, all is well. 
keep that in perspective, 1 a.m. We're hearing people today, flights are getting canceled from Southwest, from American Airlines. Um, there's a major, major tornado, like I want to say outbreak belt going through the panhandle of Florida right now that's affecting a lot of flights. But people are like driving from Dallas, which is like, we looked, it's like 19 hours. I can't even fathom trying to make it on time for a cruise. 19 hours. And a lot of these people don't have trip insurance. And it got me thinking, we didn't get trip insurance. We never have. But I almost might the next time, now that I think about it. Because there's a real possibility that if you don't get to your port on time, the ship's not waiting for you, right? The ship is going. So, do we recommend travel insurance? Yes, hands down. It's probably worth the 100 to $200 it's gonna cost you for travel insurance. Because at the end of the day, you wanna make your cruise, right? Uh, but if you can't, you wanna be refunded for your cruise. Oh, we're stopping on the bridge. Wow. Pretty. All right, so we are on the Fort Lauderdale Riverwalk, officially. And uh, I think this area is really, really pretty. Um, so pretty. Yeah, just like the... I'm so, there's, so much happier with our choice to be here. Yeah. To be here instead of on the beach in a crap <laughs> hotel. Sorry. We looked up reviews for the hotel we originally booked, and it was not good. It was not good. Um, but yeah, like, there's this red brick uh, on both sides, just beautifully it's everything's beautifully manicured right like there's just it's just gorgeous down here um and it's a great walk it's like what 85 degrees maybe maybe i don't know 80 it's 85 degrees leanne says somewhere around there um but it's really nice it feels so good yeah it feels it feels so good feels really good to uh to be here instead of in 30 degree weather it is yellow, it is yellow card oh my god we're hearing uh, Yellow Car by Ocean Avenue. The sailboat's so huge that he's got like an escape route for the sailboat. Yeah. Anyway, so we decided to take a stroll. Um, we're having dinner tonight in Fort Lauderdale with friends, uh, which should be a lot of fun. We're going to the Voodoo Lounge. No. Voodoo Cafe. Voodoo Bayou. Voodoo Bayou. Okay. <laughs> the food there looks amazing. Hopefully, we can get some footage of the food because it looks amazing. I can imagine it's there's gonna beignets. taste amazing. There's, there's <gasps> beignets. Leanne says there's beignets. So you heard it here first. Can't wait to have beignets. What would you guys name your name your ship if you own one or your boat? Brody brought up an interesting question. What would you name your ship or boat if you had one? I think they let you have custom names. Of course they do. You always yeah. name your own ship. You can definitely name your own ship. Um, there are some massive Lots of really nice. Oh, we got a little dog. Look at him. <laughs> so cute. He's protecting his yacht. Speaking of yachts. Fit check. Fit check. Woo. Looking good. Dinner? Dinner. Dinner. I just did. My fingers didn't work right. <laughs> Let's go. Dinner time. Morning. It is cruise morning. Morning. <laughs> we, um, so collectively in the past like two days, I think we've gotten like maybe total 10 hours of sleep. Yep. Um, because we only slept four hours the first night and we went to Cycle Bar. And then last night we met up with some of our old friends from Fort Myers and we had a, a, an amazing dinner. It was four hours long though. So we didn't get back till 11 and now we're going to Cycle Bar again. And there was a time change. So 
Happy daylight savings. Yeah. It is still, I mean, the sun is coming up, but it is definitely still dark. We're gonna go left and then right again. Yeah, so it's dark right now. Um, we're gonna go cycle, we're gonna come back, and get ready, and we're gonna hop on our ship. Woohoo! Yeah! All right, guys, this is room 1114 at the Hyatt Centric. And coming in is Miss Leanne, and this is our suite. This is an upgraded suite. We had a cabana suite first, which is just a room with a cabana. But here we have Keurig, cups, um, a nice station for a fridge, and shelves. Um, this is a two bathroom, so this is nice. It's just like a powder room. And then this room pulls out, like this bed pulls out um, to a full-size bed. The curtains um, are like fully electronic, which is really cool. Yeah, it's kind of nice, nice um, touch. Like a nice little work desk here. And then we have the bedroom area. You know, we've already stayed in this room for two full days. We're about to leave for our trip. So the bed is not lovely. Yeah, we got, <laughs> in, at, we got in at 2 a.m. the first night, so there was no way we were able to do the room tour then. But and then you get the idea. This bathroom is really nice. Tons and tons of storage. Um, they give you robes, a huge safe. Um, yeah. And then we have a really, really big balcony. Yep, Brody's outside. Brody's out there right now, so we are, we'll go say hi. I was about to say we're on deck 11, but we, <laughs> we're we on the 11th floor. <laughs> well, we're also on deck 11 on the ship, so yeah. that's funny. Oh, that is funny. I didn't even think about that. Yeah. And so. here's our view. It's beautiful. And there's our beautiful boy. All right. He's the best. And this is the Hyatt Centric. We loved it. It was great. Yeah. The pool is also really awesome. Absolutely. High, highly recommend it. What do you think? 9 yeah. out of 10? 10? 10 out of 10? Uh, yeah. At least. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. You heard it there, folks, first from Traveling Trail. And we are about to get on Odyssey to Seas. Can't wait. Bye, guys. Bye. Coming up in our next video, we take you guys with us as we board the beautiful Odyssey of the Seas for a six-night Caribbean cruise. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.